Hello and welcome. We'll be preparing some slow cooked brisket today. So we have about uh, 700 grams of brisket um, that we're preparing in our slow cooker. We'll do a, a quick dryer up before with uh, uh, some basically uh, mix the dryer up ingredients together and sprinkle and cover the entire brisket. And then we proceed to preparing the brisket sauce, which uh, basically is uh, minced garlic, uh, adding in some apple cider vinegar. Uh, some ketchup but don't worry we'll add all the quantities in the description below um, so yeah ketchup uh, brown sugar uh, onion powder uh, ground black pepper and also some cayenne pepper which is optional depending on obviously if you en enjoy the heat or not in your food uh, next up is a uh, Worcester sauce mix that all together to form to form our sauce And uh, next up is basically taking our brisket and putting it in the putting it in the sauce and uh, making sure that it's uh, all of it is uh, nicely covered with the with the sauce. There we go. So um, we'll transfer obviously the this to our slow cooker and we will be cooking this at a low temperature for eight hours once the eight hours are over it will look somewhat like this as you can see we prepared the roasting tray we will be transferring the meat to the roasting tray we have preheated the oven to about uh, 200 degrees Celsius, which is about 425 Fahrenheit. We'll leave that in the oven for about five to 10 minutes. And in the meantime, we'll be transferring the biscuit sauce into a saucepan in, and we'll uh, reduce uh, to reduce and thicken. After those five, 10 minutes in the oven are over, we'll take the uh, sauce that's already thickened a little bit and we'll cover and baste the meat. And we'll pop that into the oven for another five minutes. This basically serves for uh, to form a, a glaze and a sort of a, a crust on, on the brisket. So we pull that out one last time and give it another uh, basting with the with the sauce. And once those uh, another five minutes, we pull it out, let the meat rest, obviously, um, and uh, we start cutting it up. Uh, as you can see. Uh, it's it turned out very juicy and very tender. Uh, we cut it up into these nice, nice slices, and uh, we decided to uh, serve this with some roasted sweet potatoes and some homemade coleslaw as well. So you can see this part. Uh, delicious how, how tender because it's literally breaking down on that knife yep and that's the finished result I should be very happy with this so and obviously finishing off with the thickened sauce that we were preparing before so a nice a generous uh, coating of the sauce and as we said some coleslaw and sweet potatoes well i hope you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe and feel free to leave us some feedback and suggestions in the comments below see you next time